the two brothers began to fight over the worship. They are fighting over the worship. Cain is fighting the brother over the worship. And God comes down to Cain and he asks Cain, why have your countenance fallen? If thou do well, can't I bless you? Praise the name of God. Now you see how the enemy hates anything that is blessed. For the Bible says, and God accepted the offering of Abel and blessed Abel. And it was after Abel was blessed when the brother rose against him. Praise the name of God. There are some of us in this place. The Lord is asking, why has your countenance fallen? Why are you fighting your brother? Why are you fighting your sister? Why are you fighting your neighbor? Why are you fighting your brother-in-law? Why are you fighting your sister-in-law? Why are you fighting your colleagues at your workplace? Why has your countenance fallen? If thou do well, can't I bless you? Listen to me, ladies and gentlemen. God is a respecter of no person. <laughs> if God can bless him, God can bless you. Praise the name of God. You only need to master the principle of God's blessing. I feel it is coming. It is coming. I want you to touch your neighbor. Tell your neighbor it's coming. God has never lost a battle. So some of you in this place, you think you are in the financial fight. No, you are not even in the marriage fight. You are not in the business fight. The fight you are in is a spiritual fight. Is a faith fight whereby you need to lay hands on yourself and holler at yourself my God has never lost a battle so I can't lose this one in the name of Jesus only thing I have I wish I can talk about faith some of us we are living because of faith we don't know how a pay slip looks like but we are living we are paying our rent through faith we are buying our food through faith we are paying our bill through faith. The next miracle that God is about to do for you is through faith. Someone say faith. <laughs> say I have faith. So when this family is excited about Abel, they are excited about Cain. The Bible says she lost the two sons in one day. Now watch this. It is painful to Pray for a child. It's more painful to lose the two children in one day. So the Bible says Abel is dead and Cain is on the run. So here we are looking at a mother who have lost the two sons. Praise the name of God. Someone say this woman is going through a lot. She is dealing with so much that she cannot bear. I'm talking about the pain that interrupts the intimacy. Can you raise the strings? The pain that interrupts the intimacy. Praise the name of God. People think you are rude, but you are not rude. You are hurting inside you. People think you cannot love. How can I love when I am hurting? I'm talking about the pain that messes the order of your day. It's a serious pain. When you are going through this pain, there is nothing you can put together. Praise the name of God. I don't know if there is somebody in this place who have ever gone through pain. The kind of pain you you cannot really be yourself. You are messed up. Someone say the pain that interrupts the intimacy. The pain whereby nobody understands you. Nobody seems to understand you. Even when you try to explain yourself, they cannot understand what you are explaining. Praise the name of God. Someone say pain. Have you ever been in this place whereby you thought your miracle will come from here and given a little time the door was closed and you changed your focus. You thought this is where my miracle is come, will, will come from and given a little time the door was closed. You thought this is where my life is going to get better given all to time the door was closed someone say the kind of the pain that I'm going through right now is the kind of pain that interrupts my intimacy so sometimes people have to understand you praise the name of God not every time I'm happy sometimes I tell people when they come around me laughing I tell them I'm not enjoying what you are enjoying so I'm not in the mood of laughing praise the name of God now there is nothing wrong by telling people how you feel over something 
There is nothing wrong about you being yourself uh, according to how you feel about it. Praise the name of God. Have you ever gone through humiliation? Have you ever been in a violent relationship? Uh, so when people come out of these experiences and they come to a place like this, uh, you should have a big heart to mender them. We are all dealing with issues. I'm coming. We are all dealing with issues. Some of us, we are dealing with the family issues. Some of us, uh, we are dealing with the relational relationship issues. Some of us, we are dealing with the economy issues. We are dealing with the in-law issues. Have you ever been married and then your parents-in-law they rejected you? So we are all dealing with issues. But ladies and gentlemen, I have a message for you. The God you serve have never lost a battle. Praise the name of God. The enemy might have took it away from you, but I bless the name of God. The only strength you still have is the strength of the faith of God. Even though I was violated, I was messed up, I was I was walked on, I never lost my faith. I 